All right, let me tell you a story about a time that I was in Sweden. Uh, I studied abroad for like fall semester, my senior year, and uh, and then at the end, my mom came and visited, and we just like traveled around during like you know winter break. Uh, we spent some time in Stockholm, and we went. We found this like really nice little little um, cafe called Grilska Husid. If you ever go to Stockholm, definitely go and and visit there. I know it sounds goofy, but that's because it's in Swedish. Okay, um, yeah, it's in the it's in the old town section of of town, and it's right across the street from the from the Nobel Museum. It's really nice, really nice to walk around. Um, and we like we went back twice because the food there was so nice. Um, and the first time we were in there, we, like, we saw the menu on the counter, and I was like, okay, mom, it's all in Swedish, but, like, I took, I took a crash course Swedish language, uh, class earlier in the semester, and so let's just see how I do, right? Um, and so I, so I read the first item, and I'm like, okay, mom, this is some sort of egg pie. It it just says egg pie. I don't know what that means. And mom's like, okay, okay, that makes some sense. And the lady behind the counter, like, hearing us speaking in English, flips the menu around to the English side, because, of course, it's Sweden, and everything is in both Swedish and English, Um, especially, you know, when you're in a touristy area like Old Town. Um, And... And I look at the English side of the menu, and I look at the item that I had just read in Swedish, and I turn to my mom and I say, Mom, what's a kiche? And my mom just, like, laughs at me because she had failed to teach her son. I was, I was like, 22 by then, right? She had failed to teach her son what a quiche is. <laughs> And also, like, just the fact that my brain, when I'm reading something new that I've never read before, I just kind of default to, like, how would this be pronounced in Spanish? Because that's how I learned to read and write when I was a kid, was in Spanish at a Spanish immersion school. Um, yeah, so whenever you're you're trying to figure out how to pronounce something, just, like, ask yourself, on the spectrum from, like, egg pie to quiche... How French is this word? <laughs>